Okay, so here's an implementation of Sebastian Thrun's common filter. I've got three modes. One is most aggressive, one's medium, and one's uh, least aggressive. Uh, I'll show you. Let's see, I'm going to run it most aggressive first. So, it looks at the sensor, and when it's close, it backs up. When it's far away, it goes forward. So, you'll notice when it's forward, backward, forward, backward. That's no good. We want it to smooth out, because what if there's a signal noise? Okay, so drop that. Run the medium common filter. So as my hand gets closer, you'll notice it takes a little longer for it to back up. And you'll notice if I move my hand back and forth, it doesn't respond as quickly. Okay, let's fight full strength. Okay, so here it is, not believing its senses very much at all. Eventually it comes around to get in reverse. Alright, cool. Stop that. So, let's watch it in the real world. I'm going to put it back on the most aggressive mode. Ah. Alright, it's going. I'm going to bump into this box here. And it slows down. So if I hit it, back right up. But notice how it jerks around. I don't want it to jerk around. I don't want it to do that. Okay, so I'm going to stop that and try medium. Okay. Now it knows it takes a little longer to get. It doesn't believe its own sensors. Okay, let's try full strength. Eventually it gets around to backing up. <laughs> Obviously you've got to tune the common filter to be to have the right level of response. And there it is. That's completely awesome.